The custom tool viewer offers the same viewing capabilities as those available in eDrawing. So here we have the same search pane as the one that we have defined in the SolidWorks add-in. So for example, I can search for an assembly in a specific uh, project. And then we have like the search results, so I will be also able from the search to print or from per export the structure, but now we'll just open the particular assembly in the viewer. So here on the left side we can see the design tree view. And I can also use the viewer from Perl to view the custom property. So define inside SolidWorks. So the custom property will update based on the selected component. From Perl here, if I select that part within that assembly, then the custom property will automatically be updated. I can also use, for example, the, tree, the design tree view to be filtered. So, for example, if I want to search for the leg frame, then I can see that I have a two leg frame in that uh, particular assembly. I can also uh, locate where that particular sub-assembly is being used and also view the drawings made for that particular uh, sub-assembly. I can also open directly the drawings. So here I just click on the custom open drawing and custom tools automatically locate all the drawings made for that particular uh, selected component. I can also use custom tools for example to batch print my documents or uh, print specific uh, layer. Please note that the batch convention is not available in the custom tools viewer. Then I can also uh, use the custom explorer to locate uh, where the file is uh, being located or export the structure. So for example, if I want to export uh, my bill of material to an Excel report or it can be used also to be exported to my ERP.